Rice's whales are a newly discovered species. It was just two years ago when scientists announced, after examining genetic and anatomical evidence, that these whales are actually their own distinct species. They were previously believed to be a subspecies of the more geographically diverse bride's whale, and are found exclusively in the Gulf of Mexico. It is believed only 50 rice's whales remain. According to new research, their meal of choice is an abundant little schooling fish. Arioma bondi, more commonly called silver rag driftfish. Scientists say, that although common, this fish must be considered as part of conservation strategies for the critically endangered whale. Identifying their primary prey is an important first step in accelerating conservation for this newly identified species, according to Florida International University marine scientist Jeremy Kiska. Rice's whales require high-quality food, which could increase their susceptibility to climate change and fisheries impacts if their primary prey is affected. Previous research has shown that being specialized makes a species vulnerable, particularly if its preferred prey goes through a decline. Rice's whales engage in deep dives to forage for food, an effort that requires a lot of energy. While silver rag driftfish were not the only fish found in the rice's whales diet, they were the primary prey. The small fish have a high caloric content, which can give the whales more energy. They also swim in large schools, making them an easier target. Either of these factors, or perhaps both, make them an ideal meal for the whales. The limited habitat range for both rice's whales and their prey make them especially vulnerable to negative consequences of climate change. A better understanding of the physical features that promote both the high productivity and large aggregations of rice's whale prey will help improve predictions of the long-term impacts of climate change on this endangered species.